First, though, we start in Chesapeake, where the Commonwealth's attorney took out a second degree murder charge against a security guard accused of shooting and killing a 60 year old man. We told you this is breaking news at 5 30 that 21 year old Jonathan Cromwell turned himself in. 60 year old John Shang Chen's family said he was playing Pokemon Go in his van last month in the Riverwalk community when Cromwell shot him. 10 on your side's Liz Kilmer joins us in the newsroom with the latest. Laura and Deanna, these charges come after community members and even congressmen demanded answers. An attorney for the security company maintains that Chen's shooter acted in self defense, but not according to prosecutors. Now, according to the Commonwealth's attorney, uh, attorney's investigation, Cromwell confronted Chen inside his van near the Riverwalk Clubhouse three weeks ago. Chen reportedly turned his van around to leave the area. When police say Cromwell got in front of the van and yelled, Stop, he then reportedly shot Chen five times. Through the windshield of the van. He shot a 60 year old Grandpa Chang with no justified reasons, and he deserved all the charges the Commonwealth attorney brings up today. And an attorney for Chen's family says they're very gratified they're one step closer to justice for their family and for the Chinese community. Now, you might recall we saw several protests from Chinese American groups regarding this case. They're asking for this to go to trial. A lawyer for the security company says he believes, again, that Cromwell acted in self defense. The attorney says that citywide protection will stand behind Cromwell. Back to you.